Hi everyone and welcome. If you are working on the Node-RED and BACnet project and if you want to discover the BACnet devices across your network in the Node-RED, then how can you do that? Okay, so that thing we are going to see in this video. So I have one BACnet device running on my local system. I want to discover this device in the Node-RED using our flow. Okay, so after discovering device, I will get some information like the BACnet device ID, this device is running on which IP address and what is the port number for this device. Okay, so this three information we will get after discovering the devices in the Node-RED. So as you can see here, my Node-RED is up and running. Okay, and here is the BACnet uh, node to discover devices, read single point. Now how to get this node? Okay, so you have to go to manage palette here. And here you can see node red, I mean, sorry, node backnet contrib extended. So you have to install this package here, or you can say you have to install this modules here. Once you install, as you can see, it is already installed in my system. So once you install, you will get this eight node and that node you can see here, discover devices, read single point, And then there is one more change of value node. So every node is available here. You can use this node to discover your backnet devices. You can also read some single point or multi point everything. Okay. So I'm going to use this discover devices node to discover my backnet room simulator device. To discover this device, I have already created one flow. So we are going to copy the flow from our GitHub. So I have copied it. We will import it and import okay so this is the flow okay so here we have four node the last one is a debug node which will publish the uh, i mean which is which will show the payload in the debug box okay it is a timestamp node it is injecting nothing just a starting point okay and this is the function node which is injecting reuse address as a true transport close duration timeout 8000 and it will return the message so message will contain this two things okay and here i have used the discovered devices node so there is no setting in it okay it is a blank i i didn't even given the name here so you can just drag and drop this and this is our debug node okay i'm going to deploy it and uh, you can see here uh, let me extend it okay now let me deploy it now you can see here my backnet device is already running and i want to discover this backnet device using this discover devices node so I'm going to inject the parameters here and after few seconds, I will get this device information in the debug box. So we need to wait for a while. So as you can see here, we got this. And if you expand this object, you will see device ID 3588107, which is available here. And you can see the address 192.168.1.7 colon 54142. Okay, so whenever you are going to use these other nodes like change of value node or any other node, then it will ask you for address. So in that place, in that address, you have to paste this information. Okay, you have to copy it from here and then you have to paste it here. Okay, but for this video, our target was how to discover the backnet devices running on my network. So I have discovered this backnet devices using our Node-RED flow. Okay, this backnet device comes with the Yeb software. Okay, so if you search for Yeb, so this is the software, you can download it from Google. Okay, I will provide the link in the description of this video. Just download it. And once you install this software, you will get this simulator software along with that software okay and yeb stand for yet another backnet explorer so basically yeb is a 
backnet client software okay so in the same way we have used our node red as a backlit client software to discover our backnet devices so this is how you can discover your backnet device across the network so if i inject again then again i'll get the same result because there is only one device running on my network okay if i have some multiple devices running on my network and the port number 47808 then i'll get it here but right now i have only one device so that is why i am getting only one device here so this is how you can discover your backnet device across the network now if you have any concern or any doubt in this video then you can ping me on the whatsapp telegram instagram anywhere okay otherwise you can leave the comment on this video so we will meet you in the next video with the rest of this node that how to use change of value node how to read all device values or all information of device how to read a single device how to read a single point single point in the sense i want to read this 20.7 or 20.6 whatever the temperature it is okay in the node read then i am going to use this read single point node okay so we will see that in the future videos that how to use this node and how to read those information so i hope everything is okay and if you still have any question or doubt then you know where to ask so we will meet you in the next video till then Take care, goodbye and thank you.